I ain't going to be able to do this down here. <laughs> no, you're not. Just unplug the router and take it off. I'll just film it. What? I'll just film it and do voiceover upstairs. How are you going to film it? What up people, CSS Cody here. Now, if you haven't seen part one of this two part video, I'm gonna link that video up in the corner and down in the description below. And part one is going through what is the basic and what is the pro Spider VPN routers. Yes, VPN on our router, pre-configured, already done. And that's gonna take you through the differences between the two different routers and the pricing bands which you get over at Spider VPN. I will give you a little disclaimer. It's super cheap. So head over there now, link that down below as well. So this part two now is how to set everything up. So we've been through what you get, now is how to set it up. So from plugging it into your current provider's router to then going online and setting up your router through the wireless network. It is very, very simple. I am gonna do all this logically. If you're a fan of this channel, you will also understand I like to do things logically because things logically mean things are simple, which is good. Um, so we're gonna go through that, we're gonna get on, we're gonna show you uh, like how to look up your IP address to see exactly where you are in the world and how to change your IP address and change your default password if you like as well. So this will be a quite a short little video, but it'll be a bloody useful one. So remember, if you did find this video useful when you get to the end, don't forget to subscribe, share, and uh, hit us a comment up down below. And are you already a subscriber to Spider VPN, which I highly recommend. All their details are gonna be down below, so just go and do that. So let's go over to actually plugging in all the cables on the router, powering it up, and then see what we get. So this is the Pro VPN router from Spider VPN. All you simply need to do is attach the antennas and direct them however you want. Upwards is the best, to be honest. Then get your supplied yellow cable and we're gonna stick it in that blue connection right there. Now the other end of that connection needs to go into your home router in the yellow area. And then we need to power up the actual Spider VPN router and we are pretty much good to go. Once you open up your phone, you will see a Spider Pro 5.8G connection, all good to go. And then all we need to do is connect to the router, which I'm gonna show you now, and your setup is complete. So the first thing that you want to do once you are connected to the Wi-Fi of the Spider Pro VPN, you just wanna enter in 10.11.0 Point one, and this is going to give you access to the router itself and all the admin setup. Now, if you do get a password required, the password is going to be root followed by admin. And as you can see here, here is the dashboard at the moment. We are currently, we have a subscription in place. We are currently on a Norwegian server. Okay, so all of our traffic looks like it's going through Norway. Now what you need to do is go down to network and here you have your three options. Now we're just gonna be playing around with the top option, the actual router itself. So if we go into edit and you will see some further options in here. So you can see all the different servers around the world which you can connect to as you can see I'm currently in Norway at the moment. Now if you did want to change any of the locations, so we're gonna pick France and all we need to do is go down and hit save and then as you can see at the top, we've got unsaved changes. So what we need to do is hit save and apply. And this will then reconfigure the router to whatever you're requesting it. So we're looking for France. We want to be in France. And there we go. It's done. It is as simple as that. So again, we want to go into edit. And then we're going to go back to Norway. We're going to hit on save. And we're going to hit on save and apply again. So once we've done that, we can actually check our location and see where we are. So here we can see, if we zoom in, we're actually in Oslo. So a server in Oslo, which is in Norway. And so all of our encrypted, no logs, spider VPN traffic is gonna be through Norway. So anything that we're browsing on is gonna be Norwegian. Okay, so, and you can select so many worldwide servers to fit any of your needs. If you're outside of the UK and you want to watch something that you can only watch in the UK, like 
Netflix UK or BBC iPlayer, you'll simply connect to the United Kingdom server and it's as if your physical location is actually in the UK. But you can do this the same as if it was all over the world. So if you wanted to connect to the US of A to watch some Freeview, then you could simply do that. If you did find this video useful, then please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, share. And don't forget the competition over at CSSCoder.com where you can win two brand new smartphones. Thanks very much.